Good evening, I'm Haley Hines. And I'm Lloyd Towers. Thanks for being with us tonight. Developing right now, three teenagers are shot, one of them killed. After an argument turned into a shootout last night. This happened just steps from the route of last night's Gasparilla Night Parade in Ybor City. Fox 13's Evan Lambert is live tonight at Tampa Police Headquarters where they are looking for the shooters. Evan, what's the latest? Well, Lloyd, police need help tracking down those shooters. They say there were lots of people in the area last night that could have seen something. Tonight, family and friends remembered the teen who died. He was friendly, a caring person, and made people laugh. Just hours after someone shot and killed Tamika Milage's 17-year-old son, describing the person he was brings a much-needed smile to her face. Sunday, friends and family remembered Tion J. Millage by candlelight. No, he just wanted to like travel to just travel the world. Yes, and then he wanted to go to the army. Tamika says Tion had dreams, and hers were to see him achieve them. Those dreams, now memories. Tampa police say two groups of teens fought Saturday just steps from the Gasparilla night parade route near Ebor. Somebody started shooting. We had three people who were uh, who were shot. Two of them were uh, minor injuries, non-life-threatening injuries, but one of them uh, was shot in the chest and passed away. The crowd scattered and bullets flew into the nearby apartment complex at 7th Avenue and Nucio Parkway. One pierced the window of this downstairs unit, the bullet landing just inches away from a child. At the vigil a few miles away, the love shown toward Tion and his grieving mother inspired a message to the young people there. Just stay out the like out the streets and for you can stay out of trouble. Uh, you know you stay out of trouble, you'll stay, you know, stay out you'll stay alive longer. Right now, police say that a motive is unclear. Anyone with information is asked to call Crime Stoppers. Live in downtown Tampa, Evan Lambert, Fox 13 News.